Today, and after Verizon's recent announcement about shutting down the Message Plus app and how this change is going to affect users, especially those who rely on it for cross-device communication. More importantly, we'll explore some suitable alternatives that you can switch to, ensuring you don't miss a beat when it comes to your messaging needs. If you're an Android user, one of the biggest questions you might have is, what's the best messaging app for me? Through this video, we're breaking down the best messaging apps for Android and helping you figure out which one fits your needs. So, let's dive right in. First up is Google Messages. This app comes pre-installed on most Android devices and is one of the best all-around options. It supports Rich Communication Services or RCS which gives you a ton of upgraded features, think read receipts, typing indicators, and high-quality media sharing. If you're texting other Android users with RCS, it feels more like iMessage or WhatsApp than a regular SMS app. Plus, with cross-device texting, you can even send and receive messages from your computer, which is super convenient. If you're looking for something simple but powerful, Google Messages is a great choice. Next, we've got WhatsApp one of the most popular messaging apps in the world. WhatsApp offers end-to-end -end encryption, which means your chats are secure and private. It's ideal for texting, voice calls, video calls, and even group chats. You can share files, photos, and videos, and the app works on both Android and iOS, making it great for staying in touch with friends who aren't on Android. And the best part? You can use WhatsApp Web to sync your chats on your computer for a seamless experience. If privacy is your number one concern, then Signal is your go-to app. Like WhatsApp, it also offers end-to-end -end encryption, but it's considered one of the most secure messaging apps available. Signal is known for its strong privacy features, including disappearing messages, screen security, and even the ability to blur faces and photos before sharing. It's a great option for those who want to keep their communications as private as possible. Plus, it's free and doesn't show any ads or collect user data making it perfect for privacy-conscious users. Another big name in messaging apps is Telegram. This app is all about customization and group features. It supports cloud-based messaging, meaning you can access your chats across multiple devices seamlessly. You can also send large files, create channels for broadcasting to unlimited subscribers, and even use self-destructing messages in secret chats. With Telegram, you also get bots, which can automate tasks like sending reminders or helping with customer service. If you're someone who likes to tweak settings and use more advanced features, Telegram could be your best bet. For those who are already deep into the Facebook ecosystem, Facebook Messenger is a solid choice. It integrates perfectly with Facebook, allowing you to message your friends without needing their phone numbers. Messenger also supports video calls, voice calls, and fun features like stickers and filters. It's ideal if you're looking for an app that works both on Android and your desktop via Facebook's website. And now it is the end of our episode today. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel Mobile Service Center, and press like if you really like the video. See you in the next video.